let's go to uh, something we like to call social media check-in. All right, what do we got? All right, our very first one comes from a VIP Brad Squad member, Ezekiel, saying, uh, my friend is from Nigeria. He came here on a visitor's visa. He's overstayed for four years. Does he qualify for a green card and how can he get one? Uh, I don't know if he overstayed, if he overstays for his visa, if he can get one or not. Um, he would need to have a consultation just like anybody else who's out of status. Mr. Biggs on YouTube, when is the best time to renew your green card if you're going to expire um, in January of 2022? January, you want to do it six months before. So June. Yannicka Sterlizzi GN on YouTube. My husband is a U.S. citizen and I have a two-year green card. My husband just got approved for Medicaid and I have insurance for my job. Will my husband having Medicaid affect me removing my conditions? Not removing the conditions, no. But if you got Medicaid and you wanted to adjust your status, it could be a problem. Joseph Boquin on YouTube. How long does it take to get a work permit and green card if I just took my biometrics on February 1st and USCIS received my case on October 2nd, 2020? Hopefully very soon. If they received it in October, November, December, January, March or April. Esther Wamafia on YouTube. I filed for asylum and did my fingerprints in November. I'm still waiting for my interview. Can I apply for a work permit? Uh, if you did an adjustment, yes, you can apply for a work permit, of course. Fotini Park on YouTube. Uh, without having prima facie for VAWA, can I get benefits from government agencies? I don't have a work permit or income. Without getting a prima facie, you're not going to be able to get government benefits. You need to get that. So Jaka Jaka on YouTube, I got my birth certificate registered and issued last August for my employment based I-485 application. Can a late birth registration trigger an RFE? Yes. Kimberlyn Burris on YouTube, I'm doing an AOS. If I need a second affidavit, should I submit it with the rest of my documents? Yes. I'm on, B2, I'm on a B2 visa. Yes, submit Sorry. everything okay. with one time. Thanks for watching. For more Bradshaw Live, like and subscribe to our YouTube channel.